This is the story of Greza and his band of heroes. With Captain Tubestake sleeping off a serious bender, Greza time jumped and ended up thousands of years in the future right where they were before they time jumped the first time. He assembled a team and took off in pursuit of adventure. Yo, yo, yo! Which one of you cunts sounded the alarm? Yeah. Oh, it me, Phantom Boner. Me want go on adventure now. You come. <laughs> oh, he can't come, Greaser. He doesn't even have a packer, eh? Oh, that funny finger bang. Yo! My cow stick shoots millions of cow sperms at a whole bunch of dead babies. Yeah. What the fuck are you assholes doing? The captain is seriously fucking hungover, and if whoever sounded that alarm woke him up, they'd be locked in solitary for a month. Oh, it me, pretty lady. Will you come on adventure with us? We go be heroes. Greaser's heroes. Yeah, well, I guess so. But just do me a favor and don't breathe on me, you hairy piece of shit. In desperate need of a sweet side story, and with Captain Tube Stakes recovering from a serious bender, Greaser and a ragtag group of talking animals accompanied by Phantom Boner and the Finger Blaster go out in search of adventure, or some shit like that. They are Greaser's heroes. Too Many Rapes is filmed in front of a live studio audience. Greaser sat at the cockpit of the transport shuttle and took off with the crew. Greaser, I love you, baby. But do you even know where the fuck we're going? <laughs> oh, fuck you, Brian. We go help anybody that need it. That's the spirit, that's the spirit, big guy. That's what us teenage mutant ninja jabbers do. That, I'm gonna climb up people's poop shoots. I'm a bunga! Oh look, there's a family with a broken down shuttle. Let's fucking help him, dude! Oh, yes, gerbil. Me hit tow cable and... Oh, shit. Ah, you simian idiot! That was the rocket button! Oh, my bad. That was... Pretty sweet explosion, though. <laughs> Yawn. This is lame AF. I could still be in bed with the captain. But instead, I got dragged into this horse shit adventure. <laughs> That's right, Fembot. This is some weak ass shit. Oh, come on. Give the primate a break, eh? Look, there's an orbiting nightclub in the path of a giant meteor shower. Show him how a hero saves the day, buddy. Okay, me hit shield. Oh, shit. <laughs> you stupid fucking piece of shit! That's the same button you just killed that family with! Yeah! Oh, me just nervous. Third time, the charm. Let's land here, that prison camp planet, where innocent people got locked up. We we free them. All right, jackass. Just get the fuck out of the pilot seat and let me land this hunk of shit. That way, you don't just slam down into the reactor and blow the planet up with us along with it. (laughs) 
Oh, aye, aye, Fembot. This time, the stupid monkey's plan finally worked. Grease's heroes massacred all of the prison camp planet's overlords and freed all the innocent people. What came next, though, shocked everyone. Oh, finger blast, why you paralyze us? Well, I told the captain I'd bounty hunt again, and there's a huge bounty on you, cunt, for all your previous crimes. And now these new ones, I'm going to turn you all in, then take the captain in, and live large and in charge. <laughs> oh, me not like you, cunt. The Fembot, being sexy and smart as fuck, had Frankie install a failsafe plan just in case Finger Blaster acted like a cunt again. She radioed him, hoping he'd answer since he was out cold from a week of serious partying down with her. Captain? Can you hear me? Captain? Are you there? Baby? Uh, oh, fuck, baby. Uh, Daddy misses you. Is everything okay? Aw, I miss you too, Daddy. And everything's gonna be just fine. I need you to hit that special override button we made in case the finger blaster ever acted like a cunt again. Uh, aye, aye, baby. Fuck that piece of shit up. As soon as Captain Tubestakes hit the Fembot's override button, she stood up and walked right up to Finger Blaster, who kept shooting her with null rays to no avail. What the fuck, eh? Why aren't my Finger Blasts not having the same fucking effect on any of you? Because I'm smarter than you, stupid. And these blasts will have an effect on you. No. Hey. After the Fimbot killed Finger Blaster, Greaser ripped off his arm and threw it to Daxter so he could take the creepy Michael Jackson glove for research. Then he raped the corpse and torched it with his flamethrower, ensuring the piece of shit would never come back to life. Again, they flew back to Rape Force One, where Captain Tubestakes waited for them on the bridge. Uh, good job, Greaser. You're a real fucking hero in my book. Here, here's that space sheriff we murdered. It's bad. You can wear it proudly, you hairy fucking scumbag. <laughs> Aye, aye, Captain. That too many rape. Yo, yo, yo. I know you didn't forget about me and my sweet new track. I saved the best for last. Ooh. Yo. Think about it, sir. I fucking loved you, man. You were the fucking best, man. You fucking gave me so many orgasms they were like the best fucking orgasms i never had so many fucking orgasms and then you do this benedict arnold shit you fucking traitor you a fucking traitor you a fucking piece of shit finger blaster you a real piece of shit and i should have fucking known it as soon as i heard your shitty fucking finger blast pew pew what the fuck is that pew pew that's fucking weak man that's like fucking uh fucking nes style fucking music and shit it fucking sucks, man, and you fucking suck for fucking trading us. And now that you're fucking dead, I'm just gonna fuck your fucking dead corpse just like Razor did every fucking day. That fucking fucking robot head and everything, I'm just gonna fuck you everywhere. I'm gonna fuck you in your back. Nobody ever has been like a back fucker. I'm gonna fucking back fuck you. It's gonna be fucking awesome. I'm gonna fuck you in the back every fucking night. Now, and that, how does that fucking feel? You're gonna fucking stab us in the back while I'm fucking putting my big ass fucking phantom dick in your back. Yeah, fucking, you feel that? Yeah, it's kind of, it's not even, it's so small, it doesn't even fucking go through you, so it's not like it's coming out of your stomach or anything, it just kind of like lays in your fucking back. Yeah, how the fuck it feel? Yeah, you like that? You like a dick in your back, you fucking Benedict Arnold piece of shit? 
Yeah, you a piece of shit, finger blaster. Ooh.